how bad of a series is this? It's been like two months since I uploaded a uh, a walkthrough video for this. My apologies to anyone who's been actively trying to keep up uh, with this Pokemon Revolution Online walkthrough. Uh, hopefully you're watching this at the tail end of it after all of it's been recorded, but if you're playing along in real time, I apologize. <laughs> But would you look at us and we're back with episode number 14 of Pokemon Revolution Online. Welcome, welcome. Uh, whew, this series, man, I apologize. I really do that. Uh, it's, it's dragged on this long. I say this like every video for the past five videos. But uh, I'm. It, there's been uh, a recent itch for me to play it. So that's what we're doing now. So on the Route 38, our next destination is Cyanwood. And uh, I think it's Chuck that we're looking for here. All right, we made it to Olivevine City. If you're not too familiar with kind of how the Pokemon storyline goes, we have some business to take care of here before we go to Cyanwood. Jasmine went to the lighthouse for something. That's the queue right there to go to the lighthouse. To the lighthouse we go. We made it to the top and instantly Jasmine is just sitting top of the staircase. I'm sorry I'm unavailable to battle right now. Amphi here is sick again and needs a secret potion from the CN from Cianwood. I can't be bothered to go get it. Could you go get it for me? Sure thing. Oh great, thank you so much. Please retrieve the secret potion for me. So off to Cianwood we go. Sorry kid, we have some problems with our foundings. We're a small company paid by the manager in Saffron. So he fixes his problems, we can't sell, meaning we have to surf to Cianwood. Uh, if you haven't done the Saffron like side quest, I think you need a bike for it. Then, uh, you're gonna have to surf your way to Cyanwood. Alright, made it to Cyanwood. First order of business is to get the secret potion from the pharmacy down here. Uh, and then I think we're gonna try and take on, uh, Chuck, the gym leader while we're here. And this lady is the secret potion maker. Oh, Jasmine sent you for a secret potion? Here you go, dearie. Take that to Amphi and Amphi should get better fast. Easy peasy. So, up north here... Suicune's chillin'. How close can we get? I am the mighty Suicune. Fear me. Ha! You believe that? It's just a costume. I'm sure I'll win the Halloween costume contest this year. God damn it, we got baited. Oh, what the fuck? Did you guys see that? Oh my. You've seen Suicune too. He was heavily injured and also really tired. So I brought him into my house and healed him. Please keep the secret between us. I don't want him to get hurt again. Alright. Yo, Jasmine. We got your potion. Thank you for bringing this to me. Amphi doesn't take medicine from strangers. Took my secret potion. Amphi has been healed. I'll see you in the gym. What about Amphi, though? Alright. So the Olivine City Gym is pretty straightforward. The two trainers in there say, Don't worry, prove yourself at the lighthouse. Meaning, go straight to Jasmine. And get this gym battle over with. Thank you for your help at the lighthouse, but this is different. Please allow me to introduce myself. I'm Jasmine, a gym leader. Herpa derp. I use steel type. Do you know all about steel type? It's a type we has only re recently. May I begin? Still don't know how to speak. All right, starting with a Magnezone level question mark. I hope I, I'm not even actually sure if I'm. I've kind of forgot to train. Like intentionally. Tra Holy shit! My Houndoom's dead. So, yeah, this isn't going to go very well. Flash Cannon is super effective against Fairy. Did not know that. All right. If Ampharos can't kill Magnezone, we are in trouble. Zap Cannon shouldn't kill Ampharos since they're both electric type. All right. Wait, that didn't kill him. All right, that one killed him. Whew. Skarmory, I should really heal my other Pokemon. Let's see if I can get a Thunder off on Skarmory. Okay, hey, that should just be regular effective, right? Oh! Alright, we took Skarmory out with Ampharos. Magneton. Let's see. I don't have anything for Magneton. I'm just gonna heal my other Pokemon. Alright, Houndoom. Get back in there, champ. We should be good from here on that. I don't think... They have, oh, yeah, sturdy. Zap Cannon's been freaking electrifying my Pokemon. It took out um, Gramble and Houndoom. That's Pokemon's a Steelix. It's 
probably not going to go too well. It's probably like Earthquake or Rock Slide. Unless I take it out in one hit. Yeah, Earthquake might take me out in one hit. You know, I'm just going to and Croc knock out. Hit him with an Aqua Tail. Knock him out. That wasn't too hard. That first uh, Magnezone almost wiped me though. Do I want to evolve Croconada for Alligator? Nah. You are a better trainer than me in both skill and kindness. In accordance with Dig Rolls, I confer upon you this badge. You receive the Mineral Badge. More powerful Pokemon. Alright. So that wraps up our business in Olivine City. Now what we have to do is head back to Cyanwood to fight Chuck. So to the Cyanwood City Gym we go. How the fuck do I get up here? Oh, <laughs> so that's how you get up here. I thought you needed Waterfall for some reason. All right, so my plan for uh, for Chuck, since he's the fighting type, is to kind of just have Granbull tank, since Granbull's a fairy type now. Wahaha, so you've come this far, let me tell you. I'm tough. My Pokemon will crush stones and shatter bones. Watch this. Ugh, ugh. Throws away Boulder besides himself. There, scared now, are you? What? That has nothing to do with Pokemon. That's true. Come on, we shall do battle. Caveman I am. Primeape I have. Alright, so three Pokemon Chuck has. I get I have fun with those. Those gym entrances. I missed my play rough. Rough play. Okay, there we go. Alright, there. See if I can just if I can just hit land an attack. That's a that's a Lucario. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna try Fire Fame. That was a critical. I hope I don't die. I hope. Damn it. Alright, so plan failed. Grand Bull did. You know, he did a lot of damage. But I was hoping he could, uh. Oh, I sent the wrong Pokemon out. But that still worked. Oh! Uh, okay, that plays right into my hand. If I can hit this Thunder. Then I'm good. I think I'm good. That should be super effective. Easy peasy! This is, this is going by a lot quicker than I thought it would. What? Huh? I lost? How about that? I hereby confer you the Storm Badge. Storm Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. See if my Charizard were here? He would have wiped. You know why? Because he went to the gym. Alright guys, that is going to wrap up this episode number 14 of Pokemon Revolution Online. We got a lot done. Uh, we took care of Olivine and Cianwood uh, in one episode, so that's always a good thing. I hope you guys are enjoying this walkthrough. I'm, I'm trying my best to really put this out more consistently. And uh, if, if you guys are watching this after it's all been said and done, then you don't have to worry about that. But if you enjoy the video, uh, feel free to leave a like. That'd be, that would mean a lot to me. And uh, if you're new, subscribe down below. Appreciate it. And uh, you guys have a good day. Peace out, guys.